name is Rose, I'm Boba Fichi, and in today's video, you read the title, we all know what I'm doing, we're making a cat cafe. Now, if you don't know, recently, I'm not sure how recently, because I wasn't on the game, but recently, Club Roblox released a cat cafe. I checked it out in my last video, but they also added this adorable townhouse area, and it comes with all these houses. But, if you haven't noticed, most of these houses, let me show you, like, let me show this cafe, for example. The upstairs is literally empty. Like, look at this empty and the reason behind it is so you can decorate them so i thought okay 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 all right there's this coffee house why not make it a little like cafe so that's what we're doing today and sorry if my voice sounds weird yet again cannot express this enough i'm still sick i have been drinking day quill the past couple days is it working i don't know i genuinely don't know but anyways let's get started anyways first things first we're actually going to delete all these tables because while i do like them i'm going for like more of a cozy feel because like this is a cat cafe cats be running around people want to like cuddle with the cats and hug the cats this isn't really like cat huggable you know so we're gonna delete them oh wait hold up i kind of like these those are really nice couches actually we'll probably re-add those later but for now we're just going to delete everything we see even this fern although i do have these like bar tables back over here it's probably a different type and we're actually going to delete these lights because again i like the lights don't get me wrong but i don't know i just don't really like the vibe i take that's a really bad way to explain that scratch that okay we're going for a different kind of vibe so the walls i think i'm gonna brighten them up a little bit looks like all the colors i kind of like the brown let's see uh, i think okay if we had red that would look great i don't believe we have bread anymore crap this looks that looks like a sand temple in minecraft but now let's just leave the walls black and gray depressingly is it me or is everything kind of look different like more like beveled like i'm not sure how to put it looks the icons look different for some reason the icons look different i'm not going insane i swear but anyways first things first we're adding a cafe hanging frame i like these a lot i think they're very pretty but we're gonna need a lot of plants for this build and so far that actually looks really good but i feel like the black is just like way too much it is like i'm a color for first so we need to change this Let's see, let's try to like make it round and see how that looks. Like at least this one wall. And like we can use the brick as like an accent. Because I like the brick, I really do. But I'm not a big fan of everything that's being straight up black. How's that? That brines it up a lot. Holy crap. And the flooring, I do like the flooring. But I feel like it would look better darker, actually. It's like a little bit- Yes. That, like, spruce look looks good. I like it a bit darker. I like that, actually. I really like that. And then the roof, I'm gonna just gonna make it white. It's like your stereotypical- Whoa, wait, hold up. I could do, like, wood for the roof. I feel like that's overdo- it. Hold up. Okay, let's, like, look at it from this angle. Like, this one sliver. Let's do, like- the spruce is i feel no i feel like it's too much you know what i was gonna paint like this one grayish white for now in this color of day but so far i'm actually really liking this i already know i'm probably just gonna like copy and paste this around i would do like just straight up like a solid like that but i feel like i'd be like overdoing it make it like it will make the roof look too like full so we just like spread them around a little bit and we're gonna see how that looks let's i actually kind of like that well, I'm not sure. Okay, so like stay away for a few minutes and like see what it looks like when we come back. Okay, we're coming back. I like it. I really do. Maybe if I connect them, it's like do like oh, I can't connect them. Oh, wait, hold up. Can I just like do that? How's that? Oh, I kind of like that. I'm gonna scoot this one over slightly. That way it fits properly. We're just like copy and paste this one like over here, just to make it easier on the knife because I do not want to struggle with this for 14 hours. Do that. How's that look? I kind of like that. We're gonna keep it. We're keeping it. Okay, we're keeping it. Now I definitely want to keep these shelves over here, but not for shelving reasons. No, come on, no. We're gonna make it a cat wall, but I'm not sure about having it so close to the register and like all the food. So we might move it over like. Uh, I don't want it on stairs. You know, I just want to keep it over here. Why not? I'm just going to like copy and paste like more shelves over here. Make this one a bit longer. So like, make it where cats can actually climb up here. Make this one a bit lower. It lets me. There we go. How's it looking? That's looking cute. I'm going to use a tortoise hide and like make it look like a tunnel right here. Oh gosh. Oh wait, I can just put it in the wall. Like, would that come out the other side of the wall? It won't! Hold up, that's actually nice. Hold crap, I'm just like copy and paste it. And now I have like a little hidey hole for the cats! Wait, no, should I put it up here? Let's like see how it looks. I kinda like that. We're gonna keep that. Holy crap! Okay, I need a fish tank. I thought, oh yeah, a little fish tank look cute on the wall and they'll keep the cats entertained. I stuck myself in it. This wasn't planned. What kind of fish tank is this? Can fish actually go in this thing? Hello? I'm also thinking about putting like string lights or something right here. Because I think they'll look really cute. Hold up. Um, I'm not sure about that. Actually, let's delete that. This look. Oh, kind of like that actually. But we're going to delete that for now. Now for the walls, I'm actually going to repaint them a little bit. Um, Let's see. How's it look from the outside? Okay, so okay, so we might keep the brick on each side and make it like a brown color. Sorry again if I'm talking really 
really silently. I'm just trying to talk out my throat killing me. So how's that look with the brown? I'm not sure about it. No, okay. Let's make this an accent wall. Let's make like a muted green. I think like this green would probably work. Oh, I like it. Now I kind of want to do a flower wall on this one, but honestly, I'm not sure that'd be entirely safe. Because on one hand, it'll look really cool. But on the other hand, I can imagine a cat trying to play the flower and end up clonking their head on the shelf or something. I'm not sure. It's a very hard decision. Um, okay, let's see how it looks. Because if it looks cute, I'll keep it. If it doesn't look cute and looks like a, you know, a public safety hazard, I probably won't keep it. So while I'm putting this in, how has everyone been? I kind of ghosted YouTube for like a, a while, so I'm kind of trying to check in on you guys. I really did not mean to ghost my channel, I swear. But yeah, life's been a little bit hectic for me right now. I had to get blood work done for the first time in like years. If you don't know, I wasn't feeling good for a bit and like literally, I kid you not, like randomly for like a whole week, I just felt lightheaded and it got so bad to the point where I had to leave work early, skip work entirely for a whole day and get blood work done. And it was horrible, would not recommend. I did not realize how scared of needles I was until I had the blood drawn for me. It was not fun, would not recommend, but the people were very nice. How's that look? That looks cute actually. Oh yeah, funny story. Okay, so if you don't know, I dress more like vintage kind of in real life. I don't mean to, it just happens because apparently the 80s just looks really good on me but like i was working one day and this one chick she's like oh hey anytime i see you, you remind me of the 80s i was like what <laughs> but yeah apparently i remind people of the 80s and it's a very well-known thing that i didn't know about <laughs> how would that look that looks like a shoe that looks like someone just like threw their shoe on the roof or ceiling or whatever you call it, a wall i was kind of hoping that would look cooler i think like these shelves look like logs or something so i'm gonna do that i'm using like this rich like chocolate color for the walls not the walls the shelves Let's see how that looks um I'm not sure about it. It needs like accents. Let the cactus look up here. That's not the kind of accent I was looking for. Let's delete that. How would this look up here? Hold up. It adds something. Hey, what's this? Holy crap. That's a whole tree. Huh. That would actually look really cool like in the middle of the room. But the ceilings are too small. Hold up. Can I like delete the ceiling? Oh. We can combine these. Oh my goodness. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. I have so many ideas. We can combine like this upper floor and make some like really cool. Hold up. Because realistically, what do I need two other floors for? Because I ain't using them. We're putting this up here. I'm getting really sidetracked. I should probably be focusing on the bottom floor. But am I going to do that? Absolutely not. So you're going up here. And you need to be flooring. But more specifically, uh, grass. How do I get grass? Okay, there's grass. I think we use like the lighter one and see. That's perfect. That's that's literally perfect. We're gonna come back to this in a second. For now, we're just like gonna ditch here and go back downstairs. Now, one thing I'm noticing is like the light. I like like the dim lighting, but at the same time, I feel like that's not really useful. Cause don't get me wrong, I am a big fan of natural light. I like dim lights. I like I like good lighting. But at the same time, I do appreciate being able to see my coffee properly. And I'm saying this while adding a bunch of ladybugs to this wall because I like or ladybirds. Birds. Hold up. Yeah, they're lady birds. Okay. We're adding a bunch of lady birds this wall. We're gonna add like two under here with like a little heart. If I can resize the heart. Yeah, we're gonna like put a little heart right here. Paint it like red. And we're putting two right here because they're in love and I thought that'd be really cute to have. But yeah, there we go. Oh Jesus. Okay, let's turn off these because that would that instantly just wants my eyes to just pop. I also got like a tuft of grass. Oh goodness gracious. A tuft, not like a whole prairie of grass right about <sighs> I hate how the resize thing is literally in the way. Put it right there. That looks adorable and you cannot convince me otherwise. We're at another set of flowers right here. Kind of like fill that space. That looks cute. I like that. And now we're going to add some LED strips and like put it on the ceiling. For one thing, it's mainly just to add more lighting in here. That way it's not so dim. Because again, I like the ambience, but like I'm not liking how dark it is at the same time. That's really just a personal preference, if anything. I'm just going to use these like kind of like highlight this wall, I guess. That's a light switch. I just turn off my LEDs on accident. I was wondering why they went dim all of a sudden. Yeah, we're just gonna highlight this wall. There we go. And how's that look? I like that, actually. That looks really cute. Put some underneath the shelves. I just put some on the shelves. What am I thinking? Oh, yeah. Fun fact about me while we're barely in a cafe. When I was in high school, I actually wanted to learn how to code on Roblox. So I ended up actually building two cafes on Roblox Studio. Funny enough, someone actually found the cafes on my Roblox profile. I was like, oh, we have secret cafes on our profile or secret builds or something like that. I don't remember exactly what they said. But yeah, they weren't like extravagant or anything, but they were pretty fun to build. Oh, goodness 
gracious, Lord Bordacious, oh my gosh. I definitely overdid it with the LEDs. Let's see how that looks. I kind of like it, but at the same time, I feel like we're just overdoing with the LEDs, so we kind of like remove that. I definitely want to add something to these shelves, but I'm not entirely sure what exactly. For now, let's just leave it like that. Now, as for the roof, I'm actually going to add some spotlights to kind of like even out the room. That way, like, it's just more like not so- oh wait, what? I forgot about this one. But anyways, so that way it's more of like an even kind of lighting in here. Because again, I like more yellow tone lighting, but at the same time, you know, I gotta see the color of my coffee or like what color my scones are or something. It has been forever since I went to a coffee shop. Oh my gosh. Like from the top of my head, the last time I went to like a coffee shop was like, I think like when I was in middle school. And like, that's not including like Starbucks or something. That Does Starbucks really count as a coffee shop? Well, what am I saying? It's a, it's literally a coffee brand. I'm like hide some like, um, in within this to kind of like even out the middle. Ah, no. Now now it looks too bright. Okay, I'm gonna delete these ones, hopefully. Does it, like, help? I hate lighting stuff. I hate it. Because, like, you always get like, these weird gaps. No, okay. We delete these and try LEDs around the room to see how that helps. Building is about trial and error, so that's what we're doing right now. We had our trials, and now we're doing our errors. That made probably no sense, but hey, I never said I was good at words. Kind of, like, spread it around the room. Hopefully this helps with the lighting, because, like, I want it to not be, be, like, random blotches of, like, good lighting and bad lighting and meh lighting, you know? I'm also gonna put some on the floor. Just kind of like even out. Because once again, I do not want bad lighting in this cafe. Because it's supposed to be like a little fancy cafe where you can like pet random cats that you don't own while you drink your expensive coffee. That's, oh, that's really helping. Okay, we're gonna keep on doing it. Why is it not like lighting up very well? I'm gonna delete this real quick. We're just gonna like delete everything on this wall. I'm gonna put one right here. And I guess like put some in the corners just like on this wall to see if that helps a little bit what's the truth um i guess we're just gonna deal with that i don't know i'm gonna go ahead and delete this one in the corner because i don't like how it looks but here is our cafe so far and i'm repaint these uh windows i'm him white to kind of like give off more like an open feel let's see that that did help oh my gosh it looks like so like uh different out here it looks like kind of like grew out here but then once you go inside it's like a little cafe like can i paint like this door okay there we go it looks cute cute i love it and i'm thinking we can add some curtains although having curtains in a cat cafe of all things might be a bad idea but i never owned a cat cafe so i don't know we're just gonna kind of like resize it to like the window-ish kind of if it lets me hold up does that look good i wish we had like those like fancy like drape uh curtains like you know like the like the fancy like little like but donk da donk donk don't you get the idea you get the idea but sadly we don't why we don't i don't know so we recolor those green no not, not that green let's make it purple like this like a great purple is that green <gasps> we can make it rainbow oh my gosh i forget i have free will sometimes and can make things literally whatever color i want but we're going with like more of an earthy feel in this build crap i'm sad to say but we're painting these orange mainly because i just want to see how it look orange oh oh i like that actually we're keeping the orange or yellow i think that's yellow actually here we go how's that that looks great and we're gonna make a little tiny one up here actually because i forgot about this window right here here we go oh oh no we can't make it oh we're gonna delete that one because I don't want a curtain in my face or anything. I think that looks adorable. Now, I want to re-add the bar that we had over here. So, let's get a new table. How many more percents do I have? Okay, I have 70. We're fine. Actually, no. I'm not sure if you want to add tables over here. I kind of want to add, like, more, like, a lounge area. Like, an area where you can just, like, plop down and just, like, lay down with a cat. I feel like sofas would be perfect for this area. It's, like, a little, like, chillax area. I'm trying to make it look like this area is kind of, like, a half circle-ish, sort of. Like, it's secluded, but not really secluded. Like, literally, it feels like I just, like, walk in, forget about the world behind me. But at the same time, if my friends want to come over, they can. I wanted to put, like, a bookshelf right here, but we really don't have any bookshelf. Oh, we have this one. I feel like that matches the vibe. I kind of wish we had, like, more furniture. Us. Like, different types and stuff besides, like, one or two of the same item that I can't really use in builds. I just think that would be nice. I'm gonna paint this, like, the same kind of chocolate brown as I did the shelves over there. Kind of, like, tie them in but at the same time i feel like an airy kind of like brown would look good here how would this one look that one's too like 
orange. Okay, no, let's keep that orange and make these like a light sage green. Let's see, like that green. I kind of like that. It looks cheerful. Let's, like make it the same green. I think I just made these two different colors. I actually have a little idea for a rug over here. We're gonna paint these like white. And this might not work, so I might end up deleting this. Wait, hold up. I have a better idea. Hold up. I was gonna use that to make a little daisy rug, but I feel like... Hold up. If I can find it. Someone recommended using frisbees in an other video for like these little cloud decals I used to do. But how would they look as a rug? I might be sounding a bit insane, but hear me out. I'm gonna kind of like smush them together a little bit and put one on top. Kind of like an orangey yellow. That's cute. Hold up. I'm like, I'm gonna turn off my interactable. That's adorable. Fix it. Oh! <gasps> I like that even better! I think it's cute. I kind of like it. I also feel like this is like too open right here. So I'm actually going to get this and put it over the window to kind of like act as blinds. That way it's like not too open, I guess. But it feels it feels more relaxed in my opinion. I'm not, I'm not entirely sure. I'm just going to paint this like white to so kind of like match. <gasps> I like that, actually. I really do. I'm gonna do that for all the windows, actually. There we go. That looks cute! It's like from the outside. Ooh. Okay, you know what? I'm not really feeling the brick walls on either side. So let's paint, like, a light yellow. That does not match the brick at all. What about this color? Or, like, this color? Oh, I hate painting walls. While these take forever to load, I'm actually gonna add some more pet stuff. Because I feel like this looks like a regular cafe, honestly. So I have, like, a little cat tower over here. Make it a bit bigger. I have a food and water dish right here. Okay, I paint the walls yellow. I kind of like it, honestly. I was, um, I'm not sure about this wall, but this wall I like yellow. I think it looks very nice yellow. Should I just keep this one brick or something? Okay, I think I might just keep this one brick and just like add some accents or something, but this is staying yellow. I like that. Paint this wall yellow back here, and I think like, I'm just gonna keep it white for the most part back here. I'm not gonna worry too much on this part because like that's a storage area. I'm actually gonna repaint the stairs too while I'm at it before I forget, because I will forget. Hold up! I kind of like this pattern holy crap it kind of glitched out a little bit and it gave us like really cool pattern i really like it i think it looks nice and again while i'm at it i'm replacing the railing with some more like i guess like older looking railing like classical i guess i'm saying all these big words that i don't really know the meaning to i think I think it's lined up properly, but I really can't tell. Oh, goodness gracious, fedacious. That's not right. And we replace this railing a bit later. But here's how it's looking so far. I'm still not sold on this brick wall right here. I want it to be like something else. Okay, I painted it back to yellow and now I'm sold. I really like yellow. I think about like adding stripes or something. I know I was going for like a neutral kind of like earthy feel, but come on it's my channel i'm not gonna do that sadly i need to try to try to like go with a theme for a build i feel like i always like don't do the theme for the build i don't mean to i just it just happens let's see i kind of want to do like stripes so let's see can i use you for stripes okay we're gonna try out leds and see if that helps or like looks good i'm kind of like go for like that geo geometrical i don't like those like random line i guess sort of things i don't know what it's called i think it's called geometrical but i really don't all I know is it looks kind of sweet. It kind of reminds you of crystals, so we're doing it. Okay, I think this one looks too straight, so I'm gonna, like, tilt it a little bit. I want to add all these LEDs at the same time. They just get so bright, so, like, I'm about to, like, get off builder mode to see if it looks all right. And I already know for a fact, just judging by how many LEDs I am adding right now, it's not, in fact, gonna look... It's gonna look like a hot mess, if I'm lucky. Oh, goodness gracious. It looks cool. It looks really cool. I like it, but, like, it looks so off look at this so many interactables i have to turn off oh that looks so sweet too sadly i'm gonna take it down all that hard work for nothing it does look cool though okay you know what? i think i know what i'm gonna add to the ceiling or wall i want to add like a cat shelf right here i thought about adding right there but i feel like that'd be a tripping hazard so yeah we're just gonna add one right here i actually have an idea we're gonna make it kind of look like a tree but not really because it'll be hard to make it look I'll make this one a bit longer than the rest along with this one too because why not make it where like this one where this one actually goes a bit it's like a bit over to the side a bit more and a bit longer so that way the cat can get on top of the shelf and i'm gonna use i'm using these velvet cushions for leaves we make that like a greenish color would this green look good i like that green that is too primary color green with this green i like that green there we're sticking with this green add like little leaves right there originally i was gonna make this look like a little tree house area i think i'm supposed to keep it like that actually i'm also gonna repaint this shelf to be the same color because it just bugs me how's that look okay we're getting somewhere but then again i feel like i don't like the color i'm so picky i am terribly sorry repaint that the same color as the shelf was earlier 
See how that looks. That blends in a lot better. You know, okay, we're gonna make like little tiny ones. Paint them like straight up like orange. If I can find orange. Okay, we might have to make it red. And make it look like a little apple tree. Because I think that would look really cute. That looks really cute. I love it. Okay, what else should I add right there? Oh, I forgot I had this. Oh my god, that would look great over there. Okay, you know what? Make this platform a bit like long. Oh, I can't make it longer. I'm gonna put like a cheese plant right here. We're gonna assume all these plants are pet friendly, okay? If they aren't, I didn't know. We're gonna assume these are fake plants, okay? Fake plants, just in case. Okay. But can we put this wall blue now? Like, unrelated. I think it'll look really cool blue. Oh, that looks cute. I actually really like that. Okay, we're keeping that blue. And you know what? This one blue too. I really like the yellow wall, but I also like blue walls. It looks a lot calmer now. Holy crap. Up here, we're gonna add like a fake butterfly. That way the cat's gonna play with. We're gonna assume that's a fake butterfly, okay? We're assuming. And you know what? Okay, now that I changed the blue, I'm actually gonna copy and paste these and did not mean to do that. But anyways, we make these like little like clouds. It's like little clouds in the sky. I think that looks adorable we're keeping it i think like right here we're adding more seating areas because like we only have this area and that's not enough for people come on let's be realistic here granted we are gonna have like more areas to sit down and play with the cats up but we also need more lounge areas inside down here so i add a little l couch right here and we're just making this a really simple like little highway for like people just to chillax and just play with cats thinking like right here we can add like a sofa chair and i think i'll make these like couches like bluish let's see how that that's cute i kind of like that i feel like it contrasts with the green oh actually okay let's make it red let's see i like the red okay we're keeping the red i'm gonna add a little side table right here i'm thinking like for the rug maybe like no, no, not that one. This one would look really good, actually. It's like we paint it greenish. No, not that green. Like this green combo, possibly ish. That looks great, and you can't tell me otherwise. I actually really like that. Holy crap. I'm gonna rotate a little bit. I really like that. And we're gonna keep this same color as a shelf. I thought we were coloring it, but I actually can't like it. It's all coming together. And I'm thinking like right here, I'm gonna add back like a bar area, like a bar table. I'll be using the marble table possibly, because I actually really like the marble table. Mainly because like there's not really that many adjustable tables in this game. Let's see. No, not worth it. Wait, actually, hold up. How about this? Make a good table. Maybe make a cool table. Not sure, like a more efficient table, but a cool one. Oh, what? Okay, we gotta keep it like that. Also, it starts to bend weird. Dang it, I forgot about that. And then we're just gonna add some little nubs at the end. Paint those nubs white. Just kind of like copy and paste them and put them at the white ends. And just hope they look good, because I have no idea how this is gonna turn out. No joke, though, I think it's like my favorite item in the game. I'm not sure why I just keep on reusing it, because like it's a good item. You can make shelves out of them, you can make ceilings out of them. Apparently, tables did not know about that part. But yeah, look at it. It's great looking, I know. I love it. It's so cute. It's all coming together. Look at it. It's so cute. I think these chairs look pretty cute. So I'm gonna use these over here. Could I put like a chair per color? Is that too close? You know what? Okay, personal discomfort is gonna be needed for this cafe. I mean, like, there's cats everywhere. So, like, having a person in your personal space isn't gonna be too surprising. Can I fit all these chairs? Like, one chair per color that's a lot of chairs holy crap it's like a whole family get together but we're gonna keep it because i like how it looks paint the chairs or designated color in white white disney color disney color i accidentally painted this one a different color than the white i actually kind of like that look so we're gonna do it with all chairs just like paint it like one shade off from a regular color no i have no idea what color this is i think this one is a darker purple so let me just want like slightly darker i guess and this one's a lighter purple purple i think or pink is it pink it might i think that's pink okay we're just gonna paint it pink look at that i love it i love it, it looks like crayons you know now that i think about it, i really did not stay with the regular the first theme i had for this cafe anyways so what should i do for over here i feel like i'm walking like miss frizzle's cafe or something which i don't mind honestly if that woman had a cafe oh i would be there like every day i love miss frizzle funny enough i was trying to figure out where i got my style from and I, I genuinely think I copied Miss Frizzle and Junie Bean Jones. Junie B. Jones. That's how you say it, I think. But yeah, whoever wrote Junie B. Jones, literally, I think I yoinked my whole personality from those books. Whoopsies. I'm not giving it back anytime soon either. 
So let me use these ones. I like these countertops. Out of all the countertops in this game, the luxury ones are my favorite. I'll make this like one shorter. Move that over there and move this one a bit more over here and do that. I think it looks good. Hopefully, fingers crossed. And we're gonna paint these purple, not purple, not purple. How would brown look? No, God, no. Maroonish pink? I'm not sure what color that is actually. This is a very hard to see. No, okay, we're gonna make these uh, orange. To kind of, oh, did not mean to paint the tile orange. We're gonna paint these orange because I haven't really used orange that much and it feels like more of an accent, so we're adding it. And we're gonna paint this like white or something. Kind of make it pop with orange accents. Boom, lemons. Kind of looks like lemons. I forgot I painted this back room orange. So I'm gonna that back to blue. It's all coming together slowly. Now I feel like there has to be like something right here. I think I'm gonna add like a pillow cloud rug. Also, these cushions are free to use. I just go to like the pack because like I just think it's easier to find over there. But yeah, as far as I'm aware, as far as I'm aware, they are free to use. How's that look? That kind of looks like a teddy bear if it turned into a mermaid. Or from this angle, a running rabbit. That's adorable, actually, we're keeping it. And add some, like, little, like, cloud droplets right here. Kind of looks like the roof's melting or something. No, we're keeping it. I like it. It adds character. And we're just gonna add some more clouds behind the counter because I think that'd be fun. I like doing these clouds for these builds. I like doing, like, wall decor because I think it's fun. This is, like, my favorite thing to do, honestly. Just, like just little clouds also i spaced out here's the clouds so far i think we're doing good look at that okay i'm not sure what vibe i went for for this build honestly but i went for something and it turned into something which is pretty chill add a little cash register right here along with a chair so add a cosmo chair and make it you will not guess what color it's gonna be it's gonna be pink that is not completely pink and we're copy and paste the counter and put it back over here in this corner. That's a way we can actually make coffee. There is some extra coffee thingamajobs and doohickeys right there. Fire alarm, just in case someone literally- Oh, Bryce, turn off. There is no fire. Gosh. Fire extinguisher in case that thing goes off again. We believe in safety in this cafe. I'm like move these flowers down right there. Oh, that's upside down. Hello. And you know what? Okay, we've been at this for about almost two hours. I think I'm gonna call it quits for today and make this a part one video. I will upload part two of this cafe, mainly finishing up the first floor and actually doing majority the second floor that I combined into one whole floor. That made absolutely no sense. And then I quit the kick in it. But anyways, Rose, how'd you like this build so far? I personally, I really like it. I definitely did not go according to plan, but honestly, when do I ever do in these builds, honestly? So yeah, comment down below your thoughts, opinions, and yeah, I will see you guys next in part two. I uh, hope you enjoyed, I hope you stay hydrated, and I hope you stay safe until then. Bye!